connection to North Metro and East Metro Tea Party, Jake Duesenberg, and my second favorite, Jack Jack Rogers. Thank you very much, Jack. Jack, you got the script, so you're starting this thing out. Go ahead. I got the script because he wrote it and say, said, say it just like this or I'm going to be really upset. But let's start with the North Metro Tea Party. Yes. What a great group. Eight coordinators over there can hardly keep up with the uh, growth. We recently had to move to the Mermaid over in uh, Moundsview because the Blue Fox got sold. Thought we had outgrown it, but we didn't outgrow the love of the owners over there. But on May 9th, we got our second chapter, and Michelle Blackman will be there. Yes. I walked around the grounds here, and there's one thing that's very important to understand. We are very individual, or are, are individuals that think very, very carefully about things. But the most important thing we have to think about is the unity to not only win each of the upcoming elections in the next couple of years, but to destroy the DFL and their socialism. You do that not by being divisive within our own groups, but by finding advantages we can work together in. I had a great chance to work with Jake in starting his party, and he's going to tell you about it. Well, the point of the script, Jack, is so you stay on it so you don't <laughs> go over our time. East Metro Tea Party meets at the Machine Shed Lake Alamo. We have a good time. We're not of uh, all of Jack Rogers' age group. Uh, we have uh, younger people, and I'm not going to take up any more time because I already got the uh, cue to give the microphone back. Thank you very much. Thank you. Kill a couple hours, ask Jack Rogers about the North Metro Tea Party Patriots.